Chengdu has a green belt. It is a 100 km long ring shaped cycleway. Most of the people on the greenway are just like me. They cycle, jog, or spend their time with family and friends. The full circle of the greenway opened in early 2022. It is built around the urban area of Chengdu and is free to the public. Linking over 120 eco parks, the greenway's keyword is natural. It is the same reason that made Kevin Yuan quickly fall in love with cycling. Starting in January this year, he has already upgraded his bikes three times. Cycling on the Green Way generally takes up 50% of my total riding, and the rest is mountain biking somewhere else. I ride two to three times a week, with an average distance of 80 to 100 kilometers. Yuan is among the millions of Chengdu residents who are more than willing to spend both time and money on sports. Data from the city sports bureau shows, in 2022, each Chengdu resident spent on average around 2,700 yuan or 375 US dollars on sports. That's 8% higher on an annual basis. That also roughly means for every 10 yuan spent in Chengdu, one is related to sports. We found that people are more willing to rent our professional bikes, which could cost 100 to 150 yuan. Instead of checking out the shared bikes, they only cost 1 to 2 yuan. On our retail business, we found that people used to consider a 1 to 2,000 yuan bike is too expensive. But now they know that it is a type of sports bike. They know it is indeed comfortable to ride on and good for health, so they would buy it. Now our bikes priced between 10 to 30,000 yuan are sold relatively well. Meanwhile, cycling is not the only sports activity derived from the greenway. Many of the sports are not on the belt, but along the belt. We have many sports activities being done along the greenway. They basically cover all. For example, the place where we are standing at is Jingcheng Lake Park. You can play many types of water sports here, including stand-up paddle boarding and kayaking. They used to be very uncommon in urban areas, but now they're all here. We have heard about this place for a while. My friends are club members here. They have spent a long time here and have kept telling us to come. Today is our first time coming here. There's a lot more along the greenway. Football, basketball, and tennis. The different kinds of sports business have all spun up in recent years. In the past, I felt that everyone was passionate about sports. But it seemed that there was a lack of areas or venues or lack of diversity. Now we have all kinds of sports areas to satisfy their enthusiasm. By 2025, Chengdu aims to hold more than 50 international and national sports events each year. The city aims to have its sports industry contribute to more than 2% of its annual GDP.